Coming up on iPads in the Classroom, we're talking about cursive writing. Hi, my name is Guy Trainen, and this is iPads in the Classroom from Tech Edge, and today I want to talk about cursive writing. Now, Nowadays, a lot of classrooms and a lot of districts have given up on cursive writing. Other places still are doing it. Nebraska is still doing it. And I've had a few teachers ask me about ways to use the iPads to practice cursive writing. Uh, I have a third grader. He actually saw the apps and was very excited about some of them. So I'll share some of the apps for cursive writing. The first one I want to share is ABC Cursive. There are actually multiple versions of this one. What I love about the ABC cursive is that it's got the audio, it allows you to choose the letters, but the most important piece for me as somebody who wants to have his child or a student practice is that it has the directions and how to do it. So you can watch the way it's done and then follow up on it and it also has all of these ways to do this on the screen and that was not as good as I'd like it to be but you can also practice use different colors and all of that let's try a B so you can see that this is very easy practice it just goes through the letters not more than that and that's with the free version the next app I want to show you with that is actually called cursive writing and this is a 99 cent app at least at the time that I got it I thought it was worth it because it did a few things and for 99 cents I got a uh, quite good value for uh, what I was doing one of the things that I love is that it has just practice looping and doing those kind of activities that really make cursive writing so there's looping there's creating the arches they're creating you know these I like things that are very hard for me and remember that while you can practice it with the finger and it helps with directionality and the order you can also get a stylus and have them practice with a stylus so you can see you can practice all of these and you can practice with uh, with the guide and without the guide uh, you can make the you can use different colors and different thickness of lines and you've got an eraser function the other thing that I love about this one is it's got the alphabet both uppercase and lowercase but even better than that it's got words so you choose a letter now you've got all the letters uh, all the words that start with D and they've got multiple examples so you see how the letters actually connect to each other so it's the next level up of practice with cursive where you've got actually words that you need to do and not just the letters so you can do this and so forth and so forth so you can make multiple words and you can see that this app allows to do a lot more and it actually goes all the way to a sentence level and you can create your own sentences and then write them so here's an example of a sentence so this is called cursive writing it's very flexible I think it's doing great things if you've got kids in your classroom that needs that practice they seem to be excited about that one a cursive practice again a, an app that helps create the letters again what you get here is the direction that you're supposed to make the letter in so it gives you that practice you can create a blank so you can see and you can repeat it without seeing actually where it's there and then you can restore it and see uh, how you compare to theirs you can choose different colors different thickness of lines and again you can use uppercase lowercase word sentence and numbers so this is another way to foster that kind of writing lots of practice again working with kids very recently actually as recently as this morning um, kids seem excited to practice this way to follow the examples and to get their cursive 
uh, to be a little bit more fluid and uh, do a lot more practice. We usually don't have enough practice time in our classroom, so that's a way also to recommend to parents uh, about apps. Most of these apps are iPad apps, but for example, ABC Cursive is also a phone app, so look for uh, opportunities for parents to also engage their kids with uh, their phone. The last one uh, is called Cursive Word. It gives you one word at a time. So again, here you're not practicing single letters. You're practicing the whole word. You, there's the whole word. There's a shadow so you can actually follow along and make those letters. And you can erase. You can go to the next word. Very simple, very straightforward very good practice. So this is another way to practice your cursive writing. So today we talked about five apps that help develop cursive writing and especially practice, 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 which is the only thing that will make uh, kids and adults, if they want to, uh, be able to write fluently in cursive. And I'll see you next time on iPads in the Classroom. <laughs>